Today we're looking at the new filter effects found in the most recent versions of Serif Web Plus, Draw Plus and Page Plus. Filter effects are typically accessed either from the Format menu or by right-clicking a selection and choosing Filter Effects from the pop-out menu. In Page Plus, however, filter effects are featured as a tab, accessible by default from the right-hand side of the screen. The first new effect is Reflection, which adds a configurable reflection to an object or selection. We can, for example, give this moon a watery reflection by altering a few settings. On the Filter Effects menu, we'll check Reflection, then increase the offset, add some blur, reduce the height, increase the opacity, and finally, add some ripples using the Intensity and Count options. Reflections can be used to add a subtle finish to logos and icons as well. The trail effect adds a three-dimensional trail to objects and is most useful for quickly giving an object depth. The effect can be fine-tuned through settings. Distance dictates the space between each trail. Angle controls the angle at which the trails are produced. Count specifies how many trails to produce from a maximum of 10. Fade controls how the trails taper off. The default is 100, which produces a smooth feathering effect. Blur Start and Blur End are used to activate and fine-tune a blurring effect. Start controls the blur at the top of the trails, and End controls the blur at the end, or bottom, of the trails. Rather than apply a feathering effect to every edge of an object, you can now use Directional Feather to apply separate feathering values to the left, top, right, and bottom. Finally, the Drop Shadow filter has two new options, Outline and Contour. The two work in conjunction to give the Drop Shadow an outline. In Page Plus, we can produce a unique effect by removing the blur completely, increasing the outline value, then experimenting with the provided graph presets to give the outline its contour. To create a custom graph, we can click and drag node points to manipulate the curve. That covers the new filter effects for Draw Plus, Page Plus, and Web Plus. For more information, see the Learn section of the Startup Assistant. Thank you for watching.